So climate change is a very slow and steady uh, variation in the uh, everyday weather and uh, weather phenomena and also in the long run. So, um, and it's not something which, which is new to us because climate change always happened in the past. Uh, but the, the difference with the modern climate change is, is that in the past it took, took hundreds and thousands of years for the climate to change. And we have all watched the Ice Age cartoon movies. They are lovely and we all enjoyed those. So what happened is we went into these phases of Ice Age and then warming period and again Ice Age and back to the warm periods. So that this is a normal cycle of climate change. But why do we have this hue and cry about the modern present climate change? The reason is because the rate of change. So what we did, uh, you know, it took like hundreds and thousands of years to happen the, the regular, the past climate change, what we have done in the present one, around 170 or 60 years, I would say, post-industrial revolution, we have made a lot of changes in our lifestyle, the industries, the factories, the way we produce our food, all the agricultural techniques have changed. The more we modernized, the more we have um, very quickly, we have pumped in a lot of greenhouse gases, mostly carbon dioxide, into the atmosphere. And uh, so how this translated is what we call the climate change. And it is the rate of change very quickly. We have moved from say around 272 parts per million carbon dioxide to 414 parts per million now. So 2021 had four, 414 parts per million. So you can just imagine how quickly, not hundreds, not thousand years, but just in 170 years, we have quickly uh, you know, just doubled and even more carbon dioxide into the atmosphere, which has never, ever happened in the history of Earth's existence. And so that is climate change, and that is the major concern of the present climate change. So I would like to hammer on this phrase, rate of change, how quickly we have changed the amount of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. Uh, greenhouse gases, why are they important? Because greenhouse gases are the more, one of the potent, most potent gases present in the atmosphere absorb a lot of energy and heat. And that is what global warming and climate change is today.